Well, hello everyone, and welcome to Organized Planner Chic. I'm Lucinda, and for today's episode of Organize It, I'm going to share with you guys what's in my pen pencil marker case. All right, let's get to it. Okay, you guys, here is my pen slash pencil slash marker case. <laughs> and it's uh, the Happy Planner one, which I'm so glad I got this, you guys. I don't know why I didn't think about it years earlier, but it is working perfectly for me. I definitely like the look of it. And I know some of you probably have this one. And you've seen it before. Um, I love that it's got this handle for carrying. And I just like the black and white with the pink look. It's really, really nice. So uh, let's go inside and I'll show you what's in here. Okay, now in the very left pocket right here, I don't have anything because when I put stuff in there because everything in here is so thick and bulky, it just, it's not level. It just kind of has a hump in it and it make, makes me worry that maybe I would have too much stuff in it and something would rip or be damaged. So I just decided not to put anything in that pocket. So right here, I have some Stabilo um, fine liners, which, you know, these are okay. Um, I prefer the Tri Plus a little bit better on the type of um, bullet journal that I'm currently using, just because it's the Michaels one that's um, the $5 kind of thinner white paper. Everything else works pretty much perfect on it. I mean, my uh, Tombow Dual Brush markers don't bleed, you know, nothing else I have bleeds but this these do bleed on there um, a little bit and so well, actually kind of more than a little bit maybe uh, but on all my other stuff it works pretty well so um, I've got some Stabilo like I said um, markers there and then I've got a broad or, or a B sorry um, drawing pencil here and I've got some more a couple more back here because this is not I kind of have different sets for completely sketching for everything but I do have some sketching tools in here because usually when you want to you know bullet journal or um, art journal or a little bit you're gonna need some pencils and erasers so I've got a B this is actually a Dollar Tree pencil uh, and the other ones in here I think all are for the a set that I bought there and then this is just um, a Pentel eraser which works pretty well as well I like how it comes through like that so um, again, this is from Pentel, and you can get these anywhere, Walmart, Target, wherever. Um, okay, and then these are usually, no, actually, I think I may have seen these at Walmart too, but I got them from an art supply store. Okay, and then on this side, I have uh, my Microns. These are all 01s here, but then, oh, one of them's not here. So there's another 01. Oh, that I keep on my bullet journal that's black because this one is like a dark 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 brown oops sorry I'm shaking the table and this one is a zero three which is my favorite one to use I'll show you the points so like here's the point can you see that for the zero three and then the zero one is you know less than half of that of course so let me show you um, just so you have an idea now I need to, I want to get some zero threes that are in different colors because all these zero ones are different colors, but they're they're really really fine, and I like having that fine tip when I need it. But sometimes I want that zero three in colors. So there we go, and then so none of these bleed in my current bullet, bullet journal. Okay, and then I've also got here some. Let's see, this these are some more of those Dollar Tree pencils. So this one is a an HB and this one is an H so this one right here where my thumb is an H okay and then in the inside of here so I'll kind of show you how this is so these are all Tombow dual brush markers and these are parts let's see did I have two sets oh right okay so I so the colors that I was telling you guys in a previous video or another video I'm not sure which one of these is going to be first but I had a video where I was showing for my current bullet journal setup and I said that those were all bright Tombow colors colors from a bright set but they may have been from a primary set so I'm just correcting myself maybe from a previous video but anyway so these are um, oh I'm not showing you what I'm doing so these are a mix of brights and 
um, primaries but I so I just put like all the blues together and the greens with a pencil this is one of those eraser pencils from uh, Faber Castell you can see that right here Faber Castell and it's just sitting in the middle there so these are all um, like I said Tombos and everything in here is Tombow and then in this bag this is a Dollar Tree bag okay love this they have these all the time and they are just my favorite I just like the way they look so I'm t showing you some of what's still in that bag or these other Tombow markers and they're not all sitting in here loosely like I could just dump them in here but I have them sitting in the bag and I turn them opposite ways just so they won't be all bulky in one direction but they're in the bag because um, if I'm taking stuff out and working on things um, and I pick up this case then I know that if I stick them back in the bag everything's not going to fall on the ground or somewhere where I might lose them so these are inside the bag and then let's see what else there is uh, the Stadler uh, Stadler eraser and just an inexpensive little um, what gosh what is the word for this this is crazy pencil sharpener <laughs> I'm getting older guys and then this is just a little notepad because you never know when you need one now I did buy recently this Faber Castell uh, pencil sharpener it doesn't go in this bag though because it would just make it too bulky but um, it's got these three different size of pencil sharpener hold holes and this one is for the um, color pencils that you get from like Prismacolor and for or from Stedler I think Stedler because they are shaped you know like a triangle and so it works perfectly this one right here will sharpen them because other pencil sharpeners just don't work for me with those um, triangular shaped pencils okay well you guys that's everything that is in my pencil pen marker case I guess this one's mostly a pen and marker case and some pencils so that I can definitely do some sketching before I do coloring um, and then I'll show you guys in a separate video kind of my, what I take with me if I'm only going to be using pencils okay well thank you guys so much I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already I am trying to reach 1200 subscribers this year and I am at 1100 yay I'm so excited because I'm going to do a giveaway for you guys whenever I reach that. So just got a hundred more to go. Hopefully I can do that before December 31st. And so also want to remind all my subscribers that you get an additional discount from my Lucinda Dory Planners Etsy shop when you subscribe. And that discount is in the comments below. And there's a new one every month. And until next time, everyone, happy planning.